Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Donna Marie Trego, the world's best Lady Gaga impersonator. From Cardiff to New York, Vienna, Jakarta and Madrid, Donna's show has travelled all around the world acting in theatres, clubs, pride ceremonies and private parties portraying Lady Gaga. Donna's popularity and reputation puts her as one of the best tribute artists of the world. But who's the person behind the makeup, the costume and the curtain? Who's the person behind the character of Lady Gaga? Who's Donna? My name is Donna Marie Trigo and I am a Lady Gaga impersonator. Sing a little for me. I guess so, if you say so, some of us just like to read. One second. I travel the world um, pretending to be Lady Gaga and um, performing shows with live dancers, with the band. And when I'm not doing that, then I'm performing as myself or organising events in nightclubs. And when I'm not doing all that, I'm also being a mum and a wife. And my husband, Nigel, he helps me with my gigs and uh, my video editing and my music. Um, and sometimes he acts as a manager for me. I've been a sound engineer since I was early 20s. I've had three recording studios. That's how I met. Donna. Um, I went to see a friend of mine who was a singer, a, a mutual friend, and Donna turned up that day and um, we got talking, I told her I had a studio, I said do you want to come back and see my etchings, <laughs> do you want to come back and see my studio, <laughs> and um, so she came back and she recorded and the rest is history really. So I've been a singer around the pubs and clubs for years and years and years, um, and what happened was is... Um, Lady Gaga was coming to Cardiff, a friend of mine owned a bar, I used to run some theme nights there, they decided to have a Lady Gaga night, um, so I organised the theme and about two weeks before they asked me if I would dress up as Lady Gaga, so they hired a tribute for the evening, uh, the tribute act turned up, um, she, was, she was good, at that very point in the show my husband has come running through and said oh my god, you could do this because I'd actually gone into the evening dressed up as Lady Gaga to host the night and at that point didn't realise that I actually looked like her and it was only that people had actually been asking me all night if uh, they could take photos with me. So when we left the venue we chatted about if he thought that it could work and um, he was like well you're getting older now so if you're going to do it you need to decide now because you don't want to regret it in a few years times and the following morning I got up very early, bought my own website address, phoned my friend who's a costume designer and told him to come over. Here we are six years later. With more than 60 costume replicas behind its doors, Donna's garage is stuffed with the most iconic and popular stylisms replicas of Lady Gaga. Um, I was the first impersonator, Lady Gaga impersonator in the world to have a spark bra. It's been like a really good show seller for me. It's like that only got to go off and like for that 30 seconds people are screaming. Anyhow, come on Peg, let's go. In the centre of Cardiff, the crew of Donna's dancers gather once a week to rehearse for future shows. Right. Um, but yeah, working with Donna <coughs> is great. Um, we always have a laugh when we go out on gigs. Uh, I love it. She keeps you on your toes, she's really energetic, really direct, and she'll tell you what she's thinking. Yeah, she's really, really good at what she does. It's nice, yeah. She's really nice, really Horrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking, it's really good. I've been a tribute artist, keeping up with her costume. I'm always on my phone and my computer. In this job, if you're not um, answering emails straight away, then someone else will just take your job. Trying not to let things get you down, that's really hard. As far as pros, I mean, there's no other feeling than being out on our stage and getting the applause and, you know, the, the recognition. Even fans, like, you know, coming up to you and they know who I am, even out of costume, they will say to me, thank you for doing what you do. 
as a you know an artist, then you know you're obviously doing something right. When the moon raises, Donna hits the town to take over the stage one more night. Good luck, Donna, or may I say, Lady Gaga? Let's discover it when the curtain raises in this crazy, mad Gaga world. <laughs>